My name is Trevelyan Howard. I'm the host of Trevelyan's The Gourmet Vegetarian, a vibrant new cooking and lifestyle show for this evolving green and sustainability conscious world. From raw food to vegan to macrobiotic and ovalocterian recipes, I present the full spectrum of vegetarianism. Whether you already are a vegetarian or simply interested in adding a new leaf to your diet, I invite you to enjoy this presentation. From the truly unique and delicious recipes and meat-free products, to lovely homes and kitchens, to exciting restaurants, interesting guest chefs, and exotic destinations I travel to in search of gourmet vegetarian dishes to share with you. Mmm, -mm, vegetarian. My name is Trevelyan, and I am the Gourmet Vegetarian. I spent my life cooking amazing vegetarian dishes, and I'm always searching out new ways to create healthy, delicious, meat-free recipes and pair them with fine wines and vegetables. So come along and join me, Trevelyan, the Gourmet Vegetarian. Now let's cook a great meat-free meal. show Trevelyan's The Gourmet Vegetarian, where we travel to personal kitchens, acclaimed restaurants, and exotic locations to bring you gourmet vegetarian dishes you can cook at home. Tonight we're at Roseanne and Dennis's home here in Laguna Beach, California, right on the ocean, what we call the California Riviera. And we're going to do kind of modern Mexican cuisine. For our first course tonight, it's going to be a variation of a chili riano. We're going to take these beautiful poblano chilies, we're going to sear them over the open flame, and then we're going to stuff them with uh, freshly shucked sweet spring corn. And it's going to be sauteed with a little bit of coriander, and paprika, garlic, salt, and pepper, and uh, sweet onion. And also then integrated with a little ricotta and extra sharp uh, cheese from uh, New Zealand. Once that's stuffed, we're going to roll that with a little cornmeal and olive oil and oven roasted. When those are done, we're going to serve a little bit of a side with that, a jicama slaw, fresh jicama, which we're going to peel and uh, grate. We're going to serve that with some uh, sweet uh, uh, organic peppers and finish it tonight with a little bit of a fresh lime uh, and fresh cilantro vinaigrette with just a hint of habanero. So first thing we need to do is soften up these poblano peppers. We're going to sear them or score them kind of in the open flame. Right over here, we're going to crack them right away when you hear the moisture coming out of them. Now let's take a few minutes to get these nice and softened up. We're going to take this fresh corn, which I've already uh, taken off the exterior on. We're going to shuck it. I'm going to cut that right in half. Okay, I'll just go ahead and just go right down the side of this fresh, beautiful spring corn. Comes right off. With a nice sharp knife, that is. Now I'll go ahead and break this up a little bit. It kind of sticks together. See how that mmm, almost perfect raw, delicious. Okay. I'll add this. A little bit I've already shucked off. Okay. I'm going to get our skillet over here working, get a little extra virgin olive oil on there, uh, mix a little of the sweet onion with a little bit of the garlic, get it in there, excellent, a little splash of vegetable stock, homemade of course. Okay, let's get that sweet corn in there. Make it even sweeter. Flutter in a little bit of paprika, a little bit of coriander. I'll let that saute for a bit. Our peppers are looking pretty good, softening up, getting a nice grilled exterior to them. Get these off here now. We'll let those cool for a little bit before we have all the stuffing ready for it. Corn is sauteing very nicely up. Mm, it smells delicious. Well, that's working now. The peppers are chilling a little bit. We'll work on a little bit on our stuffing with the, uh, the ricotta cheese and the extra sharp cheese. 
Okay, well, we're gonna get some of this fresh ricotta cheese. Then we have a little bit of the extra sharp cheese. We're gonna integrate that together. As our stuffing for the uh, chili riano. And I add a little bit of this fresh cilantro I got at the farmer's market. Sweet cilantro, it's uh, end tips here. Almost looks like dill. Mm, fresh, beautiful. Okay, let the corn cool down a little bit. Now I'm gonna mix this in with the ricotta, and the extra sharp cheese, and the fresh cilantro tendrils. Put that in there. Now I'll loosen it up a little bit, a little bit easier to play with. Get in those peppers. Okay, we'll get our little palano pepper here, nice and uh, soft. Got a nice little grilled flavor to it, almost a chipotle flavor to it. We're gonna do a little bit of a surgery here. A little bit of a tea at the top, and we'll open our little patient up here. And yeah, there are a few little seeds. So we'll get these pulled out of here, that pretty clean. So have it opened up, we'll stuff it full. Some of this beautiful sweet corn. Okay, once she's plump and full, we'll kind of put her back together again. Put a little bit of goodies in there. Terrific. Now we have this uh, stuff. We're going to get a little bit of uh, cornmeal and olive oil and rub it and kind of give it a nice cornmeal crust. Okay, we got a few of these peppers all ready to go. We'll grab one of our peppers here. Here's a little bit of olive oil. And just kind of roll a little bit of cornmeal on top. Terrific. And another one. Get that out of there. All right, let's place these. in here nice and snug. Okay, a little cornmeal here on top, nice little crust on there. Now yeah, we'll put that in the oven uh, for about 20 minutes, about 350. 